Good morning, everybody. Happy Marco Monday. Hi. Yes, guys. Hi, pretty girl. Hi. Good morning. Happy Morpho Monday. It's a beautiful day in the fabulous Florida Keys. Hi, Rhett. Thank you for the order, Debbie. Hi, Scarlett. Hi. Good morning, Parker. Hi, everybody. Happy birthday, Amy, and all those other June birthdays. Happy birthday. Happy Flag Day. Happy Monday. Good 
Good afternoon, Scotland. Good evening, Australia. Good morning, everybody else. Happy day. What do flamingos eat? Out in nature, flamingos eat whatever they can get out of the surf. Here in captivity, flamingos eat flamingo complete. It's that bowl right there. Looks like dog food. It's called Flamingo Complete. It's shrimp and vitamins and minerals. Other flamingos in captivity get it broadcast, scattered into the water, and then they eat it out of the water like they do out in nature. But Brett and Scarlett never learned how to eat like that, and they prefer to eat it out of their bowl. So they put a little bit in their mouth and then they take it down to the water and they filter it. And then eventually it makes its way all the way down their neck into their tummy. Good morning, Violet. Happy birthday. Lots of birthdays today. Well, hello, look at you. We'll go with Good Day Gouldian. Nothing rhymes with y'all's names, but you're really pretty. You're my little favorite. Spit too long at the dinner table. You're so cute. I wish they'd stay next to each other so you could see this one is so much more round than his friends. Just a little bit fluffy. Ready for a long winter's nap. When flamingos lay eggs, they have one egg at a time and they lay it in a nest that they make that's piled up like that. Brett's over there working on a pile that would be a nest, theoretically. There, Scarlett's having some breakfast right there. She's pulling up her beak. And she'll go down to the water and filter it. The new birds, how are that, um, the Gouldians that we were just looking at here. One came back over to the bridge railing. There's a few different varieties of Gouldian finch. Flamingos in captivity live around 60 years, six zero years. Out in the wild around 45 years.
The Turaco seem to have abandoned the nest building and they haven't been seen mating lately. So I think that chapter might have closed for this year, this season. We could hold out hope, but yeah, they haven't been back over there near their nests lately. Well, Susie says we're not getting our hopes up for a nest this time. Well, I feel like if a watched pot never boils, if we don't obsess over it, maybe it'll actually happen. They can have babies, yes, if they wanted to. Only that one little chubby Gouldian. He's so cute. He's so cute. No other birds could compare to Rhett and Scarlet. But Rhett and Scarlet aren't really birds either. They're family. feeding the baby. The purple, the purple flower back there is a golden dewdrop. Duranta. They are growing fast. Yeah, they're less than a week old and they're pretty big. And there's another nest over here, just to my right, that has a baby in it that's, I think mom has decided it's ready to be out there in the world. Because Melody said yesterday she watched all day where he was trying to fly and mom was sitting and watching. <laughs> he didn't make much progress. Yes, two babies and one mama in that nest. Mama and baby over here. Oh, 
they were there last night, but they're not now. I guess he learned how to fly. These doves are diamondback doves. I am not great with the old Latin, but I did put their scientific name on the Sunday photo lineup yesterday. We'll see if we can, there's Booger. And then we'll go look at the golden dewdrop plant. Yes, they're diamondback doves, mama and two babies. And there's Booger, the day gecko. Bellas of some Madagascar's union Kochi. Day gecko, Booger. So there's multiple golden dew drop in here right now. They're a wonderful nectar source and they're super pretty. This one here. Those sad butterfly plants were removed for rehabilitation. Wow, and Melody's brought us Atlas eggs. Those will eventually Emer come out as the caterpillar for the atlas moth like you guys saw in the sunday photo roundup the other day thank you that's a lot and Scarlet are quiet. I'm probably having breakfast. Happy Morpho Monday, everybody. Hope you all have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow for terrific Turaco Turtle Tuesday. Thank you all for walking with me. Have a great day. You too, Bruce. Thank you all.